Hi there guys, Luis from Vintage Action and today guys I'm going to talk to you about American Cyborg Steel Warrior, this cult classic that was released in 1994 starring Joe Lara and John St. Ryan. Uh, this one was one of my favorites like uh, growing up uh, it was like big especially um, uh, like video stores like VHS and this one was released in Germany as you can see here uncut and HD remaster in 2016 by DDS Digi Dreams and guys this one is the only way you can get can get like a HD copy of American Cyborg Steel Warrior because this one was not released here in the UK uh, like in HD or in US or only in Germany they released this cult classic that I watched many times on VHS and of course there is like DVD releases as well but on HD this is your only option and uh, the good news guys and even though this one was released in 2016 you can still find this one on Amazon UK they are selling it for roughly around 17 pounds and they'll charge you like I don't know six seven for the you know the the shipping and everything so roughly it will cost you like 23 24 pounds and uh, but it's worth it guys because you can see this is like a thin but nice sleep cover it comes with this nice sleep cover everything like in German because this is a German release it comes with some extras not it's not loaded with extras but as some as you can see it comes with the blu-ray and with the DVD as well as you can see here a lot of nice pictures from the this cold classic American cyborg American cyborg steel warrior and this is the sleep cover and you have the actual case of the Blu-ray with the original poster. You can see here Joe Lara and uh, John St. Ryan that you might know from Delta Force 3 and Joe Lara, you know, you know from Steel from three, from Frontier and a lot of uh, movies from, uh, you know, PM Entertainment like Hologram Man. And then he did many movies like for New Image with Frank Zagarino. So he has been in many cult classics B cult classics in the 90s, especially PM Entertainment and uh, New Image as well. Uh, and let me show you guys, this is like a thin case of the American Cyborg Steel Warrior. And uh, it's come with a nice kind of like a postcard, as you can see here, German one. And it comes with a nice booklet as well. You can see here behind the scenes. Unfortunately, guys, there's like uh, pictures and uh, some information about the um, the transfer and everything. And then they have like uh, they are advertising some of the the movies that they release under their banner. They split platinum cold classic banner. They they've been releasing a lot of cool cold classics, as you can see here, like Black Eagle um like angel town a lot of like movies from with uh, um you know michael dudikov so it's like a lot of cool nice movies and by the way guys uh, a lot of them uh, there's they have been released only in germany here in the uk or the us we don't have some of their releases so it's uh, great stuff they do in germany releasing these cold classics these b cold classics that's super hard to find, especially in HD nowadays. You can still find VHSs or the DVDs, but it's super hard to find these ones in like HD quality remastered. And uh, as you can see here, you have the DVD and you have the Blu-ray. As you can see, it was released by DDS, DG Dreams in, uh, in Germany. And you have the reversible like um, artwork uh you can have the alternative one or you can have the original the original one this is an amazing release guys let me know if this one was one of your favorites like uh growing up this american cyborg steel warrior and this one guys it was shot like in 92 in israel but it was only re released in 94 and this one was on one of the last films to be released by canon films theatrically so this one was released and then they released like hellbound with chuck norris uh, that one was the last film released by canon hellbound with chuck norris 
uh, it was released just after this one so for many reasons this one is still like a cult classic and this one was directed by Boaz Davidson you might know him that the guy that directed Blood Run with David Bradley and uh, directed um, Lunar Cop with Michael Perry as well and he's been involved with uh, uh, you know he was involved with Canon he was involved with uh, New Image and then later on as a producer uh, you know the Lionsgate movies like Millennium Films the Expendables so for many reasons is this is one of one of the movies you should have in your collection especially if you grew up in the 80s and the 90s when it comes to the special features guys they have like uh, three trailers american trailer german trailer spanish trailer and um they still there's like a tv version of the movie as well it's not a lot of difference between the tv version and the uncut version but the thing is if you check on the dvds like one hour 30 minutes and the blu-ray is one hour 34 minutes so that's why they call it uncut because like four minutes that you'll not uh, find uh, get on the DVD and the Blu-ray is some four extra minutes of the movie. So I think for some reason, I think I always watched the, I always seen the uncut growing up like in Portugal. I don't know guys, you in US, uh, in Portugal, I always watch this uncut version growing up. And uh, yeah, guys, uh, if you are a big fan of this movie, uh, please uh, check it out like uh, Amazon UK and Amazon Germany, you still can get your hands to this one. And it's a nice, cool special edition with the booklet and a, a nice slip cover. And you have the original artwork as well uh, on the disc. So um, you still can find it. And uh, definitely one of my favorites growing up, a B movie and still like a, a Canon, one of the, the last Canon movies. It was like distributed by, by Canon movies, guys. And uh, yeah, guys, let me know what you think about this one, American Cyborg Steel Warrior. And uh, yeah, guys, I'll be back with you to continue reviewing these cult classics, especially these cult classics from the 80s and the 90s. And, uh, and yeah, guys, uh, keep strong.